trying to talk you into just making better choices. So what you gonna do? I don't know, I thought we could take a little field trip to like a farm. Maybe if we see, you know, where the food's coming from and it encourage you guys to just eat more naturally. Uncover your ears and stop being disrespectful. Thank you. I really need the kids to see where the food comes from before it's transformed into, you know, this chemical madness and beaver booty juice is at it. Beaver booty juice is good. How can you say spinach is gross, but you're eating juice from beaver a beaver booty juice is good. You're being closed minded. You just need to try the beaver booty juice. Oh my yes. God. Mom, I know what happens when people go to farms. They become vegetarians, and I'm just not ready for that life at all. Vegetarian people are also killing the animals. How are you going to take their food? Let's go. Like, it's, they're going to die either way. You either take their food or kill them. He went to that little spot, and he's like, where'd my grass go? Gone. This is why we should kill the cows. You're going to a farm. Look, a lot of my friends have gone vegetarian from watching your little documentaries. Good for your them. little informative documentaries. I am not asking anyone to become a vegetarian. Let's just make that clear. You asking tried to you. get us to stop eating bread. There's bread that does not have boar's hair. I like my boar's hair bread. Why we need to see where food comes from? It comes from dirt, death. I really don't think the trip is gonna help. I mean, going to a farm, that's just gonna make you not want to eat stuff from a farm. You're supposed to be helping, like, encouraging this to happen. Mm -mm. Positive reinforcement is not in my pay scale. <laughs>